Hello everybody and welcome back to another Fortnite creative video. Hell yeah. You Anyways, today we are going to be attempting to complete CPT Kung Fu's death run. This death run is said to be the most hardest death run in the whole wide world. All right, everybody. I expect speedrunners to have a very difficult time even just completing the very first level. This map is made to make you rage. Except, not really, I designed it. Hi, my name's CBT Kung Fu, and welcome to my channel. If you're not subscribed, then, uh, continue watching this video, and if you like it, then subscribe, alright? The description of definitely not my death run, try to keep your cool, and watch out for level 5. I'm curious to see what level 5 is, I really am, so let's just get a sneak peek about what's going on here. Ooh, I like it. Oh, wow. Oh, and it's dark. Oh, C supporter creator, CPT Kung Fu YT. All right. Boom. If you want to support me, use code CPT Kung Fu YT in the Fortnite item shop. Thanks a lot. I swear to God, I didn't mean to start the game. I wanted to hide the stupid details. Just walk in between the two torches, 360, because it's cool. And boom, you're on level one. It's just a nice lava themed map. It's honestly, it's the easiest thing in the world. Look at this. It's, oh my, it's just, I don't know why I made the first level so easy. In all honesty, this level is actually, this level is actually very difficult. I'll just show you how to complete it. So you do hop, 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 land on an invisible thing right there. You can kind of see it from here, but it's very, hard to distinguish from the wall because it's the same color go to there to there to there to there to the lava fall to that piece there to that piece there and then you jump into the lava fall which has speed boosters like merged into it so that it can launch you up also if you would like the code to this map it's going to be above like at the top of the screen where it says cpt kung fu it which by the way is also my supporter creator code as i've mentioned it really makes my day having other people play things that i've created you know, it's really, really cool. Or just comment on this video that you played my death run and I will 100%. Oh, I made that. I will 100% love the comment up, like the comment, all that stuff. Okay, that jump right there, that's the hardest jump of the level. I'm not even going to lie to you guys or to myself, but even as the creator of this map, I still find many of the levels very difficult to complete including level one i would like to say that if you guys do play this death run don't get discouraged on level one okay once you beat it i promise level two is much more entertaining and fun to play less rage inducing as well oh that's it okay oh that's it that's not it yeah perfect this one you have to jump at the last second all right this is the run i'm feeling it we speed running it all the way <laughs> now this is the run last time i said that this this was the run it was a lie i was <laughs> how can i not beat the first level of my own map i do this day and night this is this is the the simplest thing I've done ever. Oh yeah, look at that. Impeccable. Impeccable. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Don't screw this up. I screwed it up. That was the easiest jump to make in the whole world. Oh, hello there. Oh, that's it. That was beautiful. No, don't jump over it. Swear to God. Don't run the hell off this time. Let's go. That's level one beat. All right. Now around this corner, you got a little uh, kinder surprise right here. So you, you've got to be careful. All right, everybody. Level two. Parkour 
with poison dart trap baiting. Except, I'm bad. So let's do a little overview of level two. You will bait poison dart traps as you do parkour around, along the mine rail things until you make it up into that little hole over there and then there's the second part to the level. Except if you're smart like me, you do a 200 IQ cheese that allows you to jump onto that torch and pretty much skip the first part of the level. But I'm just gonna do it the long way because I'm gonna be stuck on that for ages if I don't. Boom, now we come here. You gotta be careful because now we got two. Oh, just like that. Now you use that to come up here. Now this is a very difficult part. All right, the trick is just like that. Now you gotta give it a second or two. You run in, crouch, oh. and now we get out of here. And now we're pretty much at the end of the second part. Oh. Okay, we gotta go quick. Oh, I didn't even get tagged once. Let's go. And we're on to level three. All right, level three is just some simple ring jumps, just like that. Now you gotta be careful, cause you got traps to bait too. Only on some of the jumps, like those two. Now I might just be able to one shot this level actually, if I'm not a bot. All right, so now we jump onto this, right up here and we one shot level three. Maybe, come on. Hell yeah, baby. One shot. Beware that when you make it to level four, the checkpoint is here. Okay, this boost pad, it'll launch you to here where the balloons are. Don't forget to come back and hit this checkpoint, okay? Okay, so three balloons and you gotta go up here and dodge the trap Alright, right, so you come up, go to one side. Ah, very close. You come up here, you gotta watch out for traps there and this trap here. Bait this. Come on. Boom. All right. Two balloons again. Now, it's difficult but possible to bait this trap, which I did not do, so it'll kill me. Come on. Pull away. Just like that. And then you push to the side and make it here. Okay. Now, this part is the final part of level four. You come up like this. Move to the side. Come to this corner. Pop your third balloon, which you had. Make it to the top. Drop all three. Hit the checkpoint. And that's how you beat level four. I don't know if you guys remember, but earlier in the video, I said that the description of this map had the words beware of level five in it. Okay, so we're at level five now, and this is arguably the most difficult level in the entire death run. Let me demonstrate as to why. So basically, it's a speed level, all right? And a very, oh my God, I'm bad. A very difficult speed level at that. Now this part, not so bad. This part here, impossible. I gotta do this flawlessly. Oh. 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 I did it! Okay, that took me like five tries. It's very difficult, I swear. Um, so now, level six. Now, this level is really fun. Pretty difficult, but really, really fun. So basically, you use the speed boost to get all the way to the top. And you start by going... Boom, all right, to the next one. Be careful with this one, you'll bang your head. Now you gotta go through the door. Oh no, okay, we're fine, we're fine. Just like that. Then you just go to here. Yeah, there's a trap there, but it's just to scare you really. It can't get you. You go around the corner like that, and then next one's there. So you come out like this, forward, just like that. And now I like to land on this, and then jump across to that, and now, we come across to this one. Now here's the tricky one. So you have to go from this pad to that pad. You will not make it. Just like that. 
now you land on this and you gotta be careful this time you land on the left side you gotta drop down just like that okay and now you go over to this one so you want to push forward a little bit and then you go like pow bam ah Okay, and now you go across again. This one's much easier though. And uh, basically you go in here and you get launched this way onto this and level seven. Okay, level seven is quite long, but very fun, okay? It's a chiller level, an ice level with a zone chasing you. Anyways, you're probably gonna love it. I love it, it's, I find it really fun. And I died. That is difficult. Come on. Come on. Okay, I've made it to the last and final part. You can see level 8 right there. Oh, I did it. We beat level 7, finally. So close yet so far. I'm sorry if I'm a little bit unenthusiastic. I'm just kind of concentrating and I'm also a little angry and tired. So, a lot of emotions going on right now. Okay, so this is half a staircase, so I'm just using this as a reference. Get some extra height on that bouncer. Let's go. And I beat it this oh no wait then there's a little bit of a dropper really simple though you just drop and then you switch to one side and that's the level let's go level 10 baby how close I'm getting and still not making it three times in a row I'm getting the hang of this Ah, uh, okay, so there are walls there. As you can see, they're just invisible for some reason. I will never learn how to properly do this first part. I'll just keep doing the exact same thing, and it'll work sometimes, and it'll not work other times, you know? It's weird. That's it. Okay. We got it. This is the one. I did it! Let's go, everybody. Oh my god. Invisible walls for the win. We are now on the last and final level, level 11. In order for the AD ATK to launch you far enough, get in and move it ever so slightly. So I'll tell you what I'm talking about. There's an ATK right here. Basically, jump and just get in the car and move it just like that. That's it. And then die. Because, yeah. And then what you do is now you jump on the roof of the ATK and it'll launch you far onto this launch pad. And then you come here, hit that. Come here. Don't die like that. Then, yeah, that's pretty much it. Whew. That was pretty smooth. Uh-oh. Might not have enough speed time to get to the next pad. No, nope, I do. And then you drop down. 
and you're on the last part, and it is literally impossible to die. So you come across a very nice forest. Don't forget to read this. This is the final stage. Make it up the lava fall and find the checkpoint to win. Jump on the tires at the last second. So here's the lava fall. So there's two ways to come up. All right, boys. So basically, you can't beat <laughs> this map. Ah, if you make it to this stage, like this, th you can't even die at this stage. So it's basically... You just gotta reach the checkpoint. See, the tires would launch you up to there, and then you'd hit some more to get up to there, and then you'd be at the top, but... I think I moved this tree accidentally, and it makes it impossible to hit these tires. If you guys enjoyed this video, then, like I said at the beginning, make sure to subscribe, because I upload a ton of content like this, including tutorials, Fortnite high kill gameplay, and montages, and... If you'd like to support me, make sure to use code CPTKungFuYT in the Fortnite item shop, alright? And, uh, yeah, I'll see you all in the next one.